Welcome to another week in review. Sorry for being so late, people, but yeah, it was a hectic weekend. Anyway, happy 4th of July and um, may the 4th be with you. Yeah. Anyways, let's get into the birthdays. And let me tell you, yes, man, the Cancerian, them roll out. Big up on yourself, Cancerian. I'm a fellow Cancerian myself. And July, you know, July, 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 the best month in the year. Yes, my opinion. <laughs> All right, so happy birthday to DJ Tiger and Munchiwoski. That is the the Twitch family. Big up on herself, big up on herself. Happy birthday to Ingrid Levy. That's my swan sister. Venice Reed. Joan Blackwood Piercy, my cuz. Happy birthday, cuz. Chef Jones, Andrew Jones, Chef Jones, big up yourself. Happy birthday. And a big 4th of July birthday to Cassie Hayden, Brian Hayden. I wish you all a happy birthday for another anniversary. Happy anniversary. And you know, my rule, my rule for birthday celebration 30 days. 30 days. All right. Yes, so let's get into the stories. So, so far, all right. Let's start with the good, with the good story. Then first, we have some, some weird stories here. But let's get start with the good one first. So, I saw in the Jamaica Observer, Kingston, emerging, um, as fast growing destination in the Caribbean. Hmm, that's nice. So they said. Despite heavy competition globally, Kingston is emerging as the fastest growing individual destination in the Caribbean this summer. Mm -hmm. According to a recent report from Forward Keys, a leading international travel analytics firm. This was confirmed by the Minister of um, the Senior Advisor to the Minister of Tourism, Delana Seavright. Um, the news came about on the heels of whirlwind visit from Kingston. Visit to Kingston by American actress Kerry Washington, who is scheduled to call on the Prime Minister. Well, she was here. She was. She she came and she left. Celebrities included Burner Boy, Chance the Rapper, Omar Omarion, Cardi B, Offset, and Maryland Govern Maryland Governor Westmore were among recent visitors to the city. And they're saying that um according to the, the analysis, um the there's a massive rise in demand and it is reflecting that J Jamaica will be securing one point five million airline seats for the summer travel season. Can you imagine? And that represents 16% increase over the previous record set in 2019. Notably, the United States of America, Jamaica's main source market, has locked in 1.2 million of these seats. Can you imagine? 1.4 million people scheduled for coming in this summer. Well, big up on yourself. You know? As I, well, I was there in May, and I, let me tell you, that flight couldn't even take a message. To save the world, the way the flight did fall. May I tell you, I don't know what's going on. What is the buzz out there where we don't know about. But people just are going to Jamaica like crazy. Yes, well, it's a, it's a good look. It's a good look. Despite what is going on. Yes, we know, said the crime and all. But guess what? It still not stop people from travel to Jamaica. So big up yourself. All we need to do now is just get that part there in, in, in tact. Get get things rolling cut out a lot of the bureaucracy and the blue and and the red tape you mean know, of blue tape the red tape to do certain business and to get things in order get set up the infrastructure and trust me we will be the unstoppable pearl in the caribbean trust me trust me we don't even well, i mean not, every time it had to say it we don't even know what we have down there seriously seriously Come government, get an act together. So, yes, so, coming on now. So, this schoolgirl, she, 
schoolgirl, she charged with public mischief. Oh God, so she fake her kidnapping for spend time with boyfriend. Schoolgirl, according to the observer, school, school girl charged with public mischief after fabricating kidnapping 200,000 ransom. This happened in Manchester, Jamaica. A 16-year-old Manchester schoolgirl who was reported missing has been charged with creating public mischief after she fabricated being kidnapped for a ransom of 200,000 made last week to cover up her out of parish trip to visit her boyfriend. Listen to me now. When me was 16, that was the furthest from my mind. To sit down and, 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 and plan such a... No, she dangerous. She dangerous. No, somebody that for side that little girl. If she can sit down and come up with that, what else is she capable of? Anyways, um, they did not say how old the boyfriend is. It's just that them said them go to the um to the place two days after them find her. And um she attend a prominent school in Manchester. They will not in Mandeville, them will not say. Um so we don't know if the boyfriend is the same age or if he is an adult. But Little girl, all I have to say to you is, boy, sweet, you're going so are you. Trust me. Keep it up. And you will see what will happen. But I don't understand every opinion you nowadays. Who, oh, 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 How you really come up with that? Boy, I tell you, crazy. Ain't it? So then, next story now. Two men found dead. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Two men found dead in vehicle with goats in the back seat. So, we don't know all this. This is a, this is a, in Spanish, this happened in Spanish town. The life left bodies of two men were found in a vehicle parked along Salt Pond Road in Spanish town. This happened on Tuesday, last week Tuesday. The identities of this deceased have not been ascertained. The bodies were reportedly found with two Goats in the back seat of the vehicle, police said. So people pass and see this Toyota Probox car park, and you know it just looks suspicious. So them call the police, and them found they found the bodies in the trunk of the car, and the two goats them in the back seat. So now, and the police them claim said them have the goat them for safekeeping. Seriously, police. Anyway, you need to question them go out there because them are the prime witness. Them can't tell you what really happened. As a matter of fact, because the, um, the, the bodies were, had gunshot wounds. So, you no need to test the goat, the goat them paw, foot, whatever they have. If you see if they have any gunpowder upon it. Just saying. You know, they could be either suspects or prime witnesses. One, one out of the two are both. But don't make them just get off of the hook, so. But this is serious. So that means that they really come to kill them, the man, there because you know, say, goat meat expensive, and then we do anything for thief goat down there. And when you see them not take the goat and then just kill the man, them, it's really serious. It looked like that, that, that was a hit. Anyway, continue upon the goat story. Then, in the week again, them kill one goat thief over um in a old lava. The people them mob him and kill him. Uh, uh, people just had it up, have it up to here, because them just continuously a thief. The people them. not that I'm saying that it is right to take a life, but I guess the people them just have enough. And then the next thing when you carry them go to court for pre their larceny, then get one little slap on the wrist, one little one little fine where anybody can go find the money and pay it, and then gone back out there again. So people don't say, listen, we can't deal with this no more. We're taking justice in our hands. And it never go no time, I think two days later, I think Friday, Friday, or yesterday, them kill another two innocent and for killing goats. The people them just like, where will just take justice in our hands? Because the police them not do what they're supposed to do. And it is sad that the people have to do that instead of make the law take it because, again, 
we have so much laws but no consequences. Them shouldn't even have to fear one we'll find them for spend a long time in a jail. I cut off two of them fingers too. So that as it, when they go to the street, then you will know say them a go thief. Something. Leave some mark on them. So anybody see them out of the street, like a scarlet letter. So you know say, yeah, that one is the thief good. Either you print one G on your forehead or something. You understand? Because this thing you get out of the hand now, it's hard for people. Put meat, not, not cheap, you know. And for a farmer to sit down and re raise him like a goat and put him at that where if you put food on him table and somebody just come and just willy nilly just take your goat, chop it up and go sell it out of the street. After you put so much work in it, it's a, it's a, it's a wicked thing, you know. And if you lose your life over thief in goat, what a shame and disgrace. Eh? Can you imagine? So all of him funeral they know. When I go say something nice about them, the people they when you know say a, de, a thief, then thief goat. Oh, what kind of eulogy you can read at them the funeral they know? Eh? For thief goat, you lose your life for thief goat. What a disgrace. Mm. Anyways, so last week again, so this lady in O Pastor Shava. You know, the electric car, a Mini Cooper. So she came home, plugged in the car, went to bed. And the next thing, she heard a sound. She heard one sound. She never paid no mind till she heard another load of sound. Next thing, at the car that caught fire. Almost burned down the whole house. Luckily, they had to escape because it was in the driveway. So they had to escape. She and her old um, senior mother, you know, that is not well. They had to scurry out of the house through the back door thank god nobody died so and um so there goes a car but i was hearing on the news that couple months ago or so i think is two months ago they had a recall on some of the mini no what i, I don't get is um cause you know you have different mini you have mini cooper you have mini countryman and some other kind of brand you understand so we, she had a Mini Cooper, but we don't know if the, they did not state what year car it was. So we don't know if her car is in the one of the batch them where supposed to get a recall. We're in the recall. You understand? Because they might have some electric cars. They might have certain kind of issues. Them claim say so far, them not seen them say them still like investigate. But so far, them not see nothing from GPS end we could have cars. Because they was wondering if it was GPS. So we don't know. But and we know that lady is out of a car. And part, part of the house burned down. This is serious. Why the military car thing there you know. Uh, it's sticky. Very sticky. But thank God. She's still alive. So this segment now. Is what we call People when I have nothing to do with their money segment. So the first one is Pharrell. He purchased one, what you call it, a Louis Vuitton bag for one million dollars. I know me can't see what about this bag here. Let me show you the picture, people. I don't know if I can bring it, pick it up any, any bigger than that. I don't think we can bring it up any bigger, but work with this. This is the bag. That's him sitting down with the bag in his lap. Which looks quite feminine to me. But anyways, moving on. He was at um, a French luxury fashion um, show. Um, and um, yes, he bought that. That's the most expensive so far, Louis Vuitton bag for a million dollars. One million dollars. Jesus, you know me could I do with 10% of that money there? 10% of one million dollar? Could I change my life? Anyway, if you are if you are watch this, or if it even reach a video reach you, do send a hundred thousand dollars to me. Please and thank you. Cause I look like you know nothing to do with your money. Then still in a Louis Vuitton, cause it look like a Louis Vuitton week this. Some, I don't even know if it's about this. A microscopic Louis Vuitton bag 
sells for over 60,000 US. I'm going to say microscopic, you know, you have to use a microscope to see it. The thing is as small as the head of a pin. Not even, as a matter of fact, my booger bigger than it. If I pick out booger out of my nose right now, which I'm not going to do on screen, but for sure you. Can you imagine? So, <laughs> look at this nonsense here. One little teeny weeny green dot on top of the man finger. I don't know if you can see it, people. See it right or so. There it is. That little dot. But I will show you another picture where this is what it looks like under the microscope. Because it comes with its own microscope, too, you know. I don't know if I <laughs> this little teeny weeny. Not even hands can hold in that the bag there. Is there any 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 micro insect? Maybe one micro insect could have hold in there. Can you imagine this is craziness? This bag is made of photo poly, polymer resin and was created with a two photon polymerization, a form of 3D printing, and appears to be a knockoff of luxury designer Louis Vuitton. The microscopic bag is a fluorescent green tote and features the iconic LV in its center and a design similar to that of the luxury labels on the go bags, which retail for about between 3,000. Oh, so it um, look like one of the, the, the Louis Vuitton bags them with them have and it goes which goes for the price of three thousand one hundred and four thousand three hundred but because this is a microscopic bag it go for 60 add to over sixty thousand us dollars people are not to do with their money they're supposed to only could breeze come and blow off that half of your finger now or you find it jesus then richard branson as me tell you, this, this segment is now have nothing to do with their money. The, as my granny that said, dog have money in buy cheese. Richard Branson now, the man with own virgin. Yeah. Him come up with one racket. So you remember the other day, the, the wreckage, the people them where they paid 250000 for third fish food. This is one you know, him come with one racket. Galactic rocket plane and um, it is now in service. It takes 20 years But Sir Richard Branson has finally begun commercial operations with his Virgin Galactic rocket plane And it, I, I guess the plane name unity What a madness the vehicle soar high over New Mexico desert on Thursday to end Thursday gone to enable the three Italian to conduct science experiment with weightless con in weightless condition. So this double plane, this is what it looks like. Right? It is built to carry, let me tell you how much people, 800 passengers. And um just under an hour into the mission, after reaching an altitude of 4,500 feet, the carrier plane Eve then released Unity to ignite its engine and boost it to the edge of space. So everybody want to reach space all of a sudden. Oh, Jesus. At the top of its climb, the rocket plane was about 279,000 feet. We don't know how much people are going up on this, yeah? But God, go we do know. So, yes, yeah, so, I guess. So, anybody want to go on Unity can um to get to the edge of space. You are welcome to go on that plane. I will not be on any of that. <laughs> but furthermore, I'm not even careful. Um, we call it. But more know how much idiot out there would have spent that the money there. So they might go at the edge of, of space. So them claims them test it, you know. And it alright. But what if when if them load up the plane you now with 800 people? Because at first it go with three Italians. What what if it go now with the 800 people you now and something happen out there? What happened? 
they turn food for the vultures crazy i'm telling you these people crazy 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 well congrats to the um the reggae boys they want to match um the other day they give some country five love let's see how much further they will go with that yes yeah, so that's basically what i have this week for another week in review i'm gonna hurry up and get off of this thing because i'm start with the fireworks already the noise out there and i know this is to the detriment of the poor little dog them and the little puss them about the place because they're going to drive them crazy for the next couple hours until whatever time here they uh, you know ah uh, well sorry that them have no structure here so then we go out till midnight certain places you know after 10 o'clock when i used to live in wisconsin where i used to live everything stops at 10. here so florida florida is a different place it will go till all one o'clock in the morning just saying <laughs> Anyways, my dears, you have a wonderful week, and I will see you all next week. Just like, share, me I beg you no, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Um, the wall works, the wall works, the wall works. You know, just 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 click the like button, click the like button. Um, I have some information to look up for NHT as soon as I get um the information i will um broadcast it for you guys all right so you have a wonderful week and as i always say god go with you because i can't peace